Armenian Minister of Defense Arshak Karapetyan, accompanied by top military officials, arrived in Moscow today and is scheduled to meet with his Russian counterpart Sergei Shoigu. He is also supposed to have other meetings with high-ranking officials. Incidents at Armenia-Azerbaijan border pose threat to the security of CSTO member Armenia. Collective Security Treaty Organization Secretary General Stanislav Zas has said during his visit to Yerevan. He said he believed that the opportunities for resolving the Armenian-Azerbaijani border conflict politically aren't exhausted and it is necessary to continue working in this direction in the Armenia-Azerbaijan-Russia format. Following his visit to Artsakh communities, Artsakh Ombudsman Geram Stepanyan wrote on his Facebook page that the presence of Azerbaijani outposts is a serious threat to the villagers. Azerbaijan has awarded Belarus President Alexander Lukashenko yet with another medal. Lukashenko received a Friend of Azerbaijan medal in Minsk yesterday from the editor-in-chief of the My Azerbaijan magazine for great service to the Azerbaijani people. Former Gyumri mayor Vartan Hukasyan has been charged with misappropriation of numerous state or community property through criminal abuses, the press service of the prosecutor's office reported. He has not been arrested, instead he has signed a promise not to leave the city. Global heating above 1.5 Celsius will be catastrophic for Pacific Island nations and could lead to the loss of entire countries due to sea level rise within the century, experts have warned. 313 new COVID-19 cases were confirmed in Armenia on Monday. Five people died.